Hi guys, as you can see I survived the Midwest Hunters Convention and I'm back home building stuff. Didn't buy a lot at the convention but we got quite a few ideas and one of them was for this table here. It's PVC and pink foam. Build it using this stuff here. Uh, rust dust. And I'm going to, a little later on in the video, I'll show you how we made it. And it's going to be in my butcher shop. I got my meat grinders and mounted to it. And this is basically the start of it. It'll be a lot ickier. Ran out of perma blood, so I can't throw any blood on it yet. I also went over, these are a couple things I made a few years ago, and I repainted them with perma blood. They're just big piles of nasty bones and guts and just generally awesome nastiness. Like I said, they're old things. I built them a couple years ago, but perma I didn't have perma blood then and it makes a hell of a difference. And this over here is also for the butcher shop. Old wooden barrel I had laying around the house. And we filled it up with great stuff. Old bones, some from Bucky's, some from deer. And lots of perma blood. That's going to make an awesome addition in the, and then the butcher shop. My wife won't look at it, says it's, gonna, it's too icky. She doesn't need to deal with it. So. What can you do? But that's about it. I'll move on and show you the grandson and I building this this table it's tops pink foam one by fours for the frame and then three inch PVC on the legs and then the dust rust or is it rust dust I don't know put that on there it makes it look pretty nasty so we'll move on to the construction of this and let you see how we made it later
a little further back from the edges. Like that? Uh, yeah, right. Like that. That's good. Okay. Thank and you. Two more. Okay, put that down and then let's put the tabletop up there, see what it looks like. black okay then we should be good and then pvc legs okay okay, okay. 